What's up mga kaibigan? Dito naman tayo sa medyo mataas-taas na displacement sa channel natin. Kasi lately, mga pang masa or lower na mga displacement ang mga previous videos natin. Gusto ko lang i-share na nung lumipat ako dito sa Luzon, originally taga Mindanao talaga ako. Bisdak mga bait. And when I moved here, an expressway was very new to me. This is where I also got familiar with the 400cc na rule, meaning that motorcycles above 400cc lang makakadaan sa S-Lex or sa N-Lex. Or sa mga NA Expressway dito. Buti pa yung Cebu, mga makaibigan. 125cc pwede na dumaan sa CC Lex nila. Now, the Kawasaki Dominar UG, UG stands for Upgraded, na bagong labas lang this year, comes from a very reliable brand. At its price point of 195 pesos, may big bike ka na, pwede ka na dumaan sa Expressway. And this is the best option if you're looking to buy your very first big bike. 400cc talaga siya on paper. Yun yung nakastipulate sa papel. Even though yung original talaga niya na CC, according to their website, is just 373cc. Yung actual niya displacement. Ever since its launch in India, the riding community here in our country had been anticipating the release of this model. And now it's here and ready to give the riders the experience of their most thrilling adventures. This sports touring bike is a macho, adventurous, and dominating bike. It was born to sprint and the build of this bike was built for touring. The newest machine mga kaibigan has arrived in our country that is a perfect option for entry-level big biker market. Which I will agree. If you're a first-timer and you're looking to buy your big first big bike, this one is a perfect one. Now at this price point, you get a lot of features. Now this bike has a single cylinder 4-stroke DOHC. DOHC siya ngayon, the previous version ng Dominar was only SOHC or single overhead cam. Ito ay dual overhead cam. Liquid cooled engine so no worries, hindi ka mag-overheat kahit matagal ka sa biyahe. And meron din siyang DTSI. Ang ibig po sabihin ng DTSI ay Digital Twin Spark Ignition ito dalawa yung spark plug niya hindi sa mga iba conventional na motorcycles or engines na isa lang ito naman mga kaibigan ang power ng engine niya let's go ang tank capacity ng mga kaibigan ay nasa 13 liters which makes it perfect if you are going for long rides or kung nagbabiyahe ka lang around the city ang fuel consumption naman niya is around 20 to 25 kilometers per liter this is for city driving and if you're going for highway runs kaya nitong umabot ng 30 kilometers per liter not bad for a big bike eh 6 speed manual with a pre-installed crash guard na isa din to sa mga upgrades ngayon uh, correct me if I'm wrong the previous one didn't have a pre-installed crash guard. Maganda siya, mga kaibigan. Dagdag safety in case pabagsak mo ang motor mo. At imagine, <laughs> big bike, naka-big bike ka, tapos wala kang crash guard. Damn, kawawa yung legs mo. Maradaganan ng 193 kilograms na motor. That's right, ang motor na to is around 193 kilograms. So imagine ngayon, 92 kilograms ako, doblehin na lang ako, katimbang ko na yung <laughs> Dominar 400 UG. Ang suspension naman ng mga kaibigan ay upside down telescopic fork. Ito po yung sa harap. Ay yung previous version niya kasi is yung ordinary lang. Well, this is one of the upgrades. Sa likod naman ay monoshock with nitrox. Naka LED na din lahat ng ilaw niya. Headlight, taillight, and signal lights. May dalawang panel display ang motor. With the instrument panel sa usual paste na nandun sa handle. And the other one is nasa tanke. So if you're planning to buy a tank bag and you wanna use the, the display, that might not be an option. Ito naman mga kaibigan ang dimensions ng motor. Ang size pala ng mga gulong is 17 inch with a 110 over 70 sa harap and then sa likod is 150 over 60. Ang brakes naman yung mga kaibigan ay puro ABS, 230 single piston viper caliper sa likod and 320mm two piston viper calipers naman sa harap. Overall, this is one of the best bikes na pwede mong bilhin if you're looking for a big bike. If I'm even considering to buy uh, my first big bike, ito po ang bibilhin ko, to be honest. Ito po ang bibilhin kong big bike anytime soon. So, go grab one now. Kung nagtataka po kayo kung ano yung top speed niya, according sa mga vloggers na iba, 165 yung top speed niya. Pero I've seen a lot of YouTubers na maabot ng 190 kph. But to be honest, why the hell do you want to go 190 kph, bro? So drive safe, drive with the rules, follow the rules, mga kaibigan. Watch this next video. Yeah, watch that. Click on that. Kung mahilig ka ng scooter, watch that. That's the conduct click 160. And kung gusto mo naman ng Suzuki Avenis, na sabi nun sa Facebook, ay kamukha daw ni Donkey from Shrek, watch this one as well. And I'll see you sa next video. Alright, bye bye